It was on April 8, 1820, that a peasant named Yorgos Kentratus came across an ancient sculpture inside a niche within the city ruins of Milos in Greece. What Yorgos found was an ancient statue from the Hellenistic period depicting a Greek goddess. It was named the Venus de Milo and was soon moved to Paris and displayed in the Louvre. The Venus became one of the most iconic sculptures in the entire world. It was made about 200 BC and was originally done by Alexandros of Antioch. Ironically, while most assumed that it depicted Venus, researchers now say it was Amphorite, the Greek goddess of the sea, highly regarded on the island of Milos. It's slightly larger than life and was missing both arms when found on this date in 1820. Today, the place where the statue was discovered has a historical marker on a rural Greek road. I'm Dennis Daly.